Quite simply, everyone in football knows what you're referring to when you talk of El Clasico. They're the two most successful sides in Spain with such passionate fans. Stay tuned and we'll bring you all the action from the Bernabeu as Real Madrid face Barcelona. They are the two foremost teams in Spanish football, Real Madrid and Barcelona, and they're getting ready to face each other here at the Bernabeu. My name's Derek Gray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. Stuart, can't wait for this one. No, nor can I, Derek. They don't come any bigger than this, do they? The two giants of Spanish football. The atmosphere is incredible inside this stadium. Let's hope we see a top-class game as well. starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Carvajal starts with Fernand Mendy in the fullback positions. Vinicius Junior starts with Rodrigo out wide. And hand of the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. Here's the starting 11 for Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Pedri starts alongside Danny Olmo in the center of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. is underway. Danny Olmo. Kunde. Here's Rafinha. Lewandowski. That's a high quality pass. No nonsense clearance. Federico Valverde. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Rafinha. Danny Olmo with it. Really good challenge. The play getting a bit bogged down in midfield. Bellingham aimed towards Mbappe and I thought that might carry a threat but a strong punch by the keeper Lewandowski really good ball there and in with a real chance off the post and back at play well they can keep possession of it now really good strong tackle and it'll be a throw in well, he thought he might have got away with it, but the referee rightly going back and brandishing the yellow card. Rodrigo. Here's Carvajal. Bellingham. Well, if you're looking for a player to take any game by the scruff of the neck, look no further than Vinicius Junior, top quality. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, when he's playing well, he can unlock any defence. He can manipulate the ball, see a pass and beat defenders. He'll be key today. How about the cross? Oh, could be an opportunity here. And up for grabs off the keeper. It's a Barcelona corner.
Can he deliver it with accuracy? Just over the top in the end. Rudiger, Mendy has it, that's very effective, good high pressing, Chouameni, Carvajal, Mbappe, Rodrigo, return to Mbappe, Danny Olmo, Here's Rafinha. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. It might be on for them. And now Rodrigo. Rafinha. An effective challenge. Can he put them in front? Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Rafinha. Well, that's a... Could be! Well, here it is again, and he's just passed that into the net. That's a very good finish, you have to say. Well, frustration for the manager. Ancelotti needs to get a reaction from his players now. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? Vinicius Jr. and Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there. Keen to take it short here. Well, behind for another corner. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Smuggled away. Pedri. Barcelona have given it away. Mbappe in the centre. Appear to be in two minds. Well, they can keep possession now. Lewandowski. Chance maybe to use the counter-attacking ability to good effect. And the counter-attack came to nothing. Being pressed here. Vinicius Junior. Here's Valverde. Well, they have the ball once more. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And passing it well. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. Robert Lewandowski illuminating in the first half of this game, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half.
into the second half then and Real doing the chasing Balde teammates available Disappointing end to the move. Vinicius Junior. And Torres on the ball. Cutting in. Can he take advantage? And it's in! A goal for Barcelona! They are the team in charge. Well, here it is again, and you have to say the 1-2 completely opens up the defensive structure, and Lewandowski does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power, it's a great finish. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Vinicius Junior. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, chipping it. Mbappe! Well, when you're down by a couple of goals, you simply have to be opportunistic. Well, if they don't take those sort of chances, there's no way back for them here. And Barcelona showing good width here. And Lewandowski waiting. Well, they survived the attack. Nice looking pass. Well, no problems defensively. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Surely tries to lift it. Oh, a finish of real class. No wonder he's celebrating. Take a bow. Well, I have to say that's a really composed finish. He had to get that absolutely right. He certainly did that. The action continues, and Barcelona hold all the aces here. Well, a bit more in the way of precision was required. Eder Militao. Throw in here for Barcelona. Danny Olmo. And the shot. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, there it is. Barcelona have created chance after chance, and I just can't see that changing. They've been excellent. Run it well. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Well, they need to get bodies back. And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And that's a top-class finish from Mbappe. He hits that with such control. That's a brilliant goal. So on with the action. And 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Lewandowski. And now Lewandowski! Well, the keeper made the save pretty easily in the end. Chouameni. Kylian Mbappe. And they've given back possession easily. In 
one behind for him to chase. And he failed to deliver that time. Sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Rodrigo. Perfect tackle. Kunde. Kunde. A wonderful intervention. What to like about that pass? Dangerous position. It could be for Mbappe. Oh, it's off the post. Well, that really needed to go in, didn't it? Sums up their day, really. It's just not quite happened for them here. Vinicius Jr. In for the chance. Well, this is worth watching again. Mbappe beats the challenge with such ease. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. A really good pass. And he cuts in from the wing. Can they cover up? And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. The final whistle is sounded, and it's a victory for Barcelona. Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. Well, we never tire of watching Robert Lewandowski when he excels, and he certainly did in this game. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.